Hello, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be painting this painting. It's a windowsill with some pretty flowers in the windowsill um, with like this nice vibrant window and whatever background you want. So we're going to um, dive straight into me painting this one. And if you want to attempt to follow along or see the order um, that I do this painting in, feel free to keep watching. All right, here we go. very very easy painting to paint I'm very pleased with how this one came out um, so as you saw I just kind of did the background first to lay out where like the edging of the window and then the, did the window itself so it kind of could place where I want the center of the painting to be I think if I did this painting again I might make the window just a little bit bigger so there's not so much wasted space or I might do a little bit more detail along the edges um, and make it more like a brick or some sort of stone pattern along the um, edge here just so it's not just kind of this plain um, concrete wall behind. I mean it does look as it should but I definitely um, wouldn't be against having more detail in the background um, edge around the window. And then the window as you can see is very simple you just do your four rectangles um, and then I just added a little bit of subtle white um, lines subtly into the four rectangles to give that kind of reflection of light in the window. Um, and then I just did my windowsill flowers. So basically just um, tons and tons of flowers until you fill the space and it makes it um, the focus of the painting. It pulls around this area. If you, if you still are kind of focusing on the windows, you need more flowers. 
Um, but basically, as you can tell from the video, very, very easy painting to do. I literally just did circles for the roses and then did a letter lowercase e of white inside the roses to get a kind of twirl looking effect. And um, yeah, just lots of little ferns and things like that and just little leaf shapes to make the um, foliage feel really full. So that's how this painting turned out. And so that's the foliage um, and the flowers right there. And it's very, very cute. So very, very happy with that. Hopefully you found that helpful to watch and or the timeline interesting to watch. Um, and if you want to see more of these, I upload these every single month, if not more frequently um, than once every month. And so feel free to subscribe to see more. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.